Hello everyone, this is NWGoin77 here, and welcome back for some more Let's Play Hexen. So, last we left off, we're doing some more of the third hub world that we got here, the Hero Seahawks Cemetery. Doing some more exploring of the sub-hub worlds of this one, uh, including the Orchard of Lamentations, where we last uh, left off going on rummaging about this swampy, uh, misty-looking area as well. And got ourselves another one of those gemstones that we need, the Emerald Planets. And with our fourth one collected, we only need to collect two more. So let's go ahead and look for these last two. Which is right, just so happens to have one right here. What do you know? Awesome. Got ourselves the Sapphire Planet. And with that one, we already got one more to get. Yes. Uh, funny how things turn out, huh? But anyways, go through here. And we just need to look for that one last gemstone. It's one last gemstone. Uh, wherever it may be hiding, I think we need to go. Yeah. Okay. Was it through here? Because we know we just found the green one or the blue one just now, as well as the green one here. Okay. And also, we did collect our third and final part for our final ultimate weapon, the Great Bird. Definitely. I've been having fun with this as well. Yes, that's for sure. Because it's a pretty awesome weapon. Oh yes. As uh, one can tell, we're probably going to definitely need it for the later parts of the game, too, when things start to get even more difficult. Not only with regards to these puzzle solving, but also with the amount of enemies that we're fighting, too. So, yeah. But I think that's pretty much all that there is available here. If I haven't explored everything enough already, and I... Yeah, oh, there actually, there might be a way that has opened beyond where that that uh, swamp area is right over here yeah no because yeah it doesn't look like there is something behind this wall unless it's just meant to be a wall with nothing behind it but i have got this sneaky suspicion that there is probably something that they're hiding behind there. just need to figure out how we're gonna get to it maybe there's a switch we missed somewhere perhaps okay well we'll just look here have a quick look go through these areas again and no no switch here what about the other side any switch over here any at all nope not here either okay well let's just have a look up here then where we found the green gem and uh, yeah okay we'll take care of you because you're annoying and yeah, okay, maybe that maybe that doesn't open after all. We'll just uh, it's just supposed to be just a wall, I guess. Just 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 examining here, doing one last little double check of everything, because you never know. Uh, yeah, no, nothing at all. Nothing. Okay, well, let's just go ahead and make our way back to the beginning. Yes, in the beginning. <laughs> Go through here, and maybe, who knows, maybe those other barred doors have opened up now. Right? One can only hope, right? Well, I guess we're about to find out. Uh... Oh, yes, they have. Okay, there you go. See, I just hate noise. I just had to make sure. Right at the last second there. <laughs> Alright, but uh, only for our progress to get stopped once again by another set of bars right behind the original set of bars. Ah, uh, how lovely. Okay, well, that's fine by me, I guess. Just got ourselves some more puzzles to solve. Yes, more puzzles. And I think, yeah, I might as well use another one of those uh, mystical life urns. The mystic urn. As we have an excess amount of them anyways, and saving ourselves some quartz flasks. Which, by the way, yeah, I'm starting to run low on them, so... It might be in our best interest to switch to those mystic urns in the meantime. But hey, ah, I see, there's another door that opens through here. Okay, maybe the same applies for the other side, perhaps? We can find ourselves a hidden hallway or something? Nope. Only on that one side. Okay, got it. But uh, anyways, we do have those gemstones. Let's might as well place them on here now. You. And you. Hey, come on. There we go. So let's see. Two blue, two red, one green. So we just need one more green one to place on there. And we should be good. 
And that should be this area done. Yes. Good to see that they're trying to at least switch the the type of puzzles that we're doing up in here. Which is good, but uh, let's see. I think we need to go to that other storage area again. Well, we'll yeah, we'll just have a quick look through there just in case. Just in case we might have actually still missed something from the last video. So back into the storage area we go. Feeling since I yeah get to pushing those walls that will lead us to somewhere else. Since I only need one more of those gemstones left. I wouldn't doubt that they would be hiding the third one, the the final sixth one in here somewhere. Yeah, somewhere hidden from prying eyes. Only for the most authorized of elites to know where it is. Uh, too bad I killed them all, otherwise I would go to interrogate them, tell me where it is. Ah, uh, if only. Oh well, just going our, our, our chaotic evil routes works just as well, I guess. <laughs> of just murderizing everyone in our path. Oh yes, okay. Um, this is not through there. Maybe I did explore everything in here, but uh, we'll just have a quick, a quick double check in here either way. And let's see, let's see yeah, exactly there. Uh, well, according to the map, there is something behind the portal. So maybe I do need to explore behind there some more. All right, he's hitting you. And seeing what's, uh, no, no, not through here. Yeah, behind the portal, behind the portal. Because, yeah, you, you guys can see that, right? There's definitely something behind that red line there, and oh, you bastard, is that really how you're gonna do it? You're gonna wait for me to go off the elevator so you can go back up and ditch me again. Come on now. Let me up. Let me up, I say. I, I command you, elevator. Yes. Okay, back through here. Aha! Oh, you know, there is something behind here for us. That's why it's always good to... to uh, check multiple times, even in areas that you know you've already been. This is how that game. This is how this game likes to be sometimes, with all the backtracking. And what do you know? There is there our sixth and final gemstone hidden away behind this column. Go ahead and pick up that. And uh, no monster closet coming out. No surprise. Uh, no surprise attacks from anybody. Well, that's a that's a first. I will say that is definitely surprising. But uh, no matter. We got our sapphire planet, we got all the gemstones, time to head back up to the main room here and see what uh, nice reward we get for hitting all those uh, gemstones in the plaque there. Yes. Well, one can only find out soon enough here. Alright, so here we go. Let's for the elevator to take us up. And off we go, finding this out. Alright, plaque. I put all the gemstones on. What are you gonna do for me now? Okay. Oh. Now, what did it do? Did it open these up? No. Wait, what did it do? It didn't seem to do anything. What? Are you kidding me? Okay, wait. No, let's just not jump to the conclusions here. Just have a quick look. See what they got around here. And, ah, okay, it opens you. Right. Oh, as well as you on the side, but oh, hello. Also, see, we got ourselves some more un well, unwanted guests. Yes, unwanted guests. Well, you know what? They can go and uh, bask in the glory of my poisonous death clouds of gas. As they do listen to the wine as they die from it. Very good. Okay, we do have to watch out for these bishops. Yep, yep, watch out for you two behind me. And see what they got behind behind here. Okay. Oh, oh no. Oh, are you kidding me? Now we do the puzzles for this one, right? Oh my god. Well, uh, well, here we go, folks. How are we doing the puzzles on here? And it looks like, yeah, we got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9 to do here. Yes, 9. Oh, jeez. Well, I guess they only keep on going up from the first hub world only had three, and then the second one we have six, and now we have nine. But these three portals here, 
assuming it doesn't really matter which one we take first, but I'm gonna go ahead and go to this one first. Okay, it takes us to what's called the Dragon Chapel. Yes, the Dragon Chapel. Oh, yes. Oh, let's see what other horrors lie on beyond here. Whereas, yeah, now just when we thought it was all over, nope, now we're just still just getting started with this. Oh, the joys of the puzzle song here. Oh, boy. Yeah, well, I guess that would have been too good to be true to just have the, the gemstones. Yeah, no, we've got, we're not done quite yet. It's a whole other set of problems that have presented themselves. I see, yeah, a whole other set. One here, and this is Dragon Chapel first, and it looks like two other chapels as well. By the looks of things, and yeah, things are not gonna get any nicer coming in through here. Yeah, no, nope, not any nicer. I don't know. Looks like we got ourselves some more. Man, that but at least some more quartz flask as well. I'm definitely glad to take those. As well as the water that rises that'll allow us to go up there. Okay. Good, good. If you can go ahead and let me back down so we can go back up, that would be great. Alrighty then, back up we go. Hey, yes, back up we go. <laughs> Alright. Okay, back then I noticed there's some more you guys up there. As well as, oh jeez. More trouble, I see. Yeah, more trouble. We'll hit that and, ah. One night the puzzle has been solved on the monastery. Oh boy, yeah. One puzzle down, eight more to go. Eight more of those switches to hit. At least we still we know we're still on the right track though. It's not like I'm wandering around aimlessly. Not yet at least, but yeah. We still got ourselves some more work to do. Oh yes. Okay. Uh obviously can't go through there yet. Nor can I do anything else here by the looks of things. Yeah, no. Might be pretty much it for for now. So, we can only go ahead and head back to those other two portals, because I did, yeah, I did notice there's these other two ones to make. And, yep, yeah, there's our progress on the puzzle wall again. Just the one out of nine hits. Excellent. Well, I guess we'll just go back to this one then. Going to the wolf chapel. Yes, the wolf chapel here. Going from dragons to wolves now. So it's a nice change in the skybox though, at least, which is pretty nice. But also, notice that the, the sky there is moving a little bit, which is a, a, also a nice a nice touch, I will say. A nice little uh, detail to aesthetic. But uh, yeah, here we are in the Wolf Chapel, going in kicking some more ass. Particularly the asses of these centaurs. Okay, you guys are going to be like that, just accept my ghost set. Yeah, summon my ghost to tear them to shreds. Yes. Whatever works anyways, but uh, yeah, going to here. Get you guys in. Oh crap, yeah, don't, don't allow them to corner me. Oh no. Cornered by centaurs. Oh boy. Okay, so we've got some more, yeah, more chaos circuits. You guys can deal with the gas. I just quickly run around this room here. Yes, there's a lot of you guys. Okay, well, you know what they say. I need to fight fire with fire. Their fireballs against my fire spin spell. Pretty good. As that always seems to work, oddly enough. But uh, yeah, that's <laughs> that done. See what other dangers await us through here. Oh, yeah, say hello to Mr. Bishop again. Kill you. And get some of our Fletchettes back. Alrighty, still almost at our maximum. This goes to show that I'm, I'm just not using them enough, I guess, still. But, you know, yeah, I try to make use of every little bit of, bit of uh, weapons and hardware that I've got all around. Or most of it, anyways, but you know. Okay. This appears to be the main hallway of sorts. Coming in through here. And, uh, yeah, more dark bishops doing their dark rituals. And by that, I mean staring blankly at their fireplace. Uh, whatever, whatever floats their boat, I guess. But, yeah. Okay. 
was, ah, I wanted to just use my mace for damage. But, well, oh, kill you, and yeah, it's also another nice thing about this Wraith Bird is that the ghosts that are, that are shot over it seem to go through the walls as they fly about to the place, which I guess makes sense, because, you know, they are ghosts after all. So yeah, pretty cool. Also, another thing reinforcing the fact that this is an awesome weapon, for sure, is, yeah, look at that, and there, no match for my Wraith Bird. No match, I say. Even after I'm done killing one enemy, they still go about killing some more. And I think it's a, a certain amount of set damage that they do before they stop flying around. Which is also nice. It's like a nice, assure, reassuring thing that you can make sure they get the job done with uh, you summon them and whatnot. But uh, yeah, we're gonna use another one of you. We're gonna use another one of you. And we're gonna go ahead and use the boots too. The boots of haste. Might as well, right? Oh, give us a nice speed boost. Because yeah, look at that. Look at that nice look at us just zooming around the place. Like Speedy Gonzales. Yes. It can't catch me. Oh yes. Got that done. That's another ninth of the puzzle solved on the monastery. Oh boy, can't wait to find that the next seven switches. Just... Oh jeez, yeah, this is what it's all about. And oh crap, okay, no, I was going to think did that go up to the ceiling and crush you? It does not actually. As a matter of fact, it does lead to another area. At least this one does. So we'll take you out, and is that another icon of the defender? Oh well, what good timing. I just used one, so just got one back. Like how that works out, but uh, also, uh, okay, no, there's no, those don't need arrows. Just the one that leads to that other area. Yep, just the one. Okay, what do we got here? Uh, some more green mana. Hello there, centaur. You can go ahead and burn in, in a blaze of fire. Yes, going out like the blades of glory, or shall I say, blaze of glory? Hey, get it, blaze? Yep, no. Okay. Go through here, and hit another switch, yes! Another ninth of the puzzle has been solved in the monastery, oh boy! That means three down, six more to go! Yeah, six more! Six more on an arrow! Okay, now I think going about by the basic math here, uh, there's three different areas here, the three different chapels, and nine puzzles to solve that would make me to, to believe that uh, there are, yeah, three, three in each chapel to get out of these ones. Yes, three more, so there should be one more left to, uh, for us to get in the Wolf Chapel. I'm not sure if we can actually get it now, but uh, we'll just have a quick look either way. And, oh, oh no, that's just the fireplace. I'm singing more torches got lit up, but yeah, no, that's no, just the fireplace. Okay, uh, oh, yeah, no, nothing in here. And yeah, I think I might have hit all the switches I need to hit, and the third one that I need to hit is beyond that metal door that I can't open. Yeah, it's the metal door, and oh! Ah! No! Ah! Yeah. I know it's somewhere. A little through. There it is. There we go. Okay. So hit the switch again for a second time, and yeah. Okay, now we're back. Yeah, sorry about that, folks. Annoyance of having to do the whole area again, but we got it all over again, and we did find actually this uh, secret door here, which led to this room, and hit this switch. I'm not sure what that switch did exactly, but uh, I know it didn't open the main door in the main hallway. So, with that being done, I think that's pretty much it for this area then. We gotta head back over to the other area. And careful not to fall in there again. Yes, not to fall. Yeah, no, that door didn't open. So, let's go ahead and head back then. So that's, what is that, three out of nine, right? Yeah, three out of nine, six more to go. Okay, so we explored in the Wolf Chapel, within the Dragon Chapel, now we go into the Griffin Chapel here. Yes, the Griffin Chapel. Alright, well, here we go once again. In order to set more enemies ablaze, I noticed there's some, some of these gargoyles hiding within these pots here. Being real cheeky bastards. It's good. Well, you guys can go ahead and go get all killed by my mighty ghosts. 
as such. But also have to watch out because, uh, yeah, looks like there's a, uh, a big old pit here. But judging by the arrow that's going forward, I guess we have a choice but to go forward and, oh, hey, what do you know? That actually helped us out and uh, given us those magical platforms to walk on. Well, it uh, just goes to show that you always uh, pay attention and do what the big precarious arrow on the ground says. Oh, yes. Because, yeah, always likes to reward you in that weird way, but, uh, yeah, got ourselves some more, more gargoyles. Yeah, that's a lot of them. Yes, yes, gargoyles. Come on, man. You can all stop being so dodgy and accept your fate already. Yes. I know it's going to take a lot more than that to kill me off. Oh, yes, and I mean uh, what I mean by a lot more, I mean by uh, give me a bottomless pit to jump into. Yes, of course. <laughs> Alrighty. So, Chaos Surface to kill, get some more gargoyles to kill. Yeah, the works. As well as, uh, ooh, there's a lot of bishops coming out to say hello. So, you know what? You. And we'll go in the. Alright. Okay. Let's see what we got to do here. Besides, once we've killed off all the enemies, that is, of course. Okay. And, oh! Another ninth of the puzzle has been solved on the monastery. That's a bit odd. Didn't even need to hit a switch for that one. Well, whatever. I took another one down, so that's four. Go to nine, so five more to get. Yes, five more still. Oh boy. Here we go. Here we go again. So we got ourselves a nice little pool of water here, I see. Pretty nice. But also, uh, more monster closets I've noticed as well. Coming up these steps. Now, no, yeah, there's still some more of these uh, bars. But hey, we've also got ourselves a nice hidden door with the, uh, that texture on it again. And we know there's another switch hidden behind it. Good, good. So that's five now out of nine. So just four more to go. Yes, just four more. Oh boy. And, uh, yeah. We're getting there, folks. We're getting there with the amount of puzzle solving that we need to do here. Just a few more to hit. We'll just take care of these guys behind these bars. Might as well do that now. Before they become a problem later on. And... Let's see, does that switch open them up? Uh, no, but does that one? Open? Ah, yes, this one does. Okay, good, good. Just going to pick all the goodies behind here, or whatever goodies we can pick up, anyways. Just because, yeah. Okay, let's see, have we been in all the areas we need to go through here? Let's just quickly check again. All right, nothing in there, and uh, nothing in here either. Yeah, nothing in there. Alrighty then. Uh, hmm. Was there another door over here? Oh no, that was uh, that's different. Okay, well that might be all that we can do in this chapel here, by the looks of things. So let's go ahead and head back to the the seminary and have a quick look at our progress. It's one, two, three, four, five. Yep, four more to go. Okay. We'll just have a quick look in the Wolf Chapel once again and see if that door is open. And indeed it is! Alrighty, good, good. Let's go ahead and go here and that will hit our... Hopefully find our final switch in here somewhere and... Oh jeez, yeah, this is a big, scary looking room if I've ever seen one. Oh yes, got ourselves more enemies to kill. And I also notice I picked up another part of the Wraith Verge. Two, which is kind of interesting. You think that uh, once you find all three parts of it, you won't need any more, but uh, no, you're still finding more parts. Which is pretty odd, but whatever. I'm sure that uh, every little bit of ammo that they perhaps would give us extra would still help and be much appreciated anyways, but uh, let's see. We got ourselves a nice big room with a very odd symbol painted on the floor. Not so much painted, just glowing. But uh, yeah, we'll just have a look through here. Find some more quartz flasks. 
as well as saying hello to some more enemies. Popping in through the ceiling there, I've noticed. That's pretty nice. Like, they really like to make a name for themselves, I guess. The ceiling poppers, yes. <laughs> That's what these guys are called. Is there the name of their squad that they've been assigned to? It's just to pop through the ceilings to, to surprise their enemies unsuspecting. Yes. Very nice, but not going to save them. Because I'm still just going to keep bashing their heads in with my mighty mace. Oh, yes. One by one. Oh, yep, yeah, come on, your turn now. Go ahead and smash both your both of your conjoined faces on your freaky body, just like any other. Yes, you're really no special, Mittens. You're really not. Alright, let's see. Go we'll through here, and... Okay, through those little rooms there, but did that even do anything over here? Doesn't look like it. We got ourselves some dragon skin bracers, which is nice. I think actually we should use that right now. Give us that extra little bonus in armor. Bringing our AC up to 10 now, which is good. So to be able to uh, protect us from some good amount of magic. We got ourselves the banishment device, and yes, there we go. That's that did it. That solved the puzzle. And with that being done, we have all of the puzzles solved on the Wolf Chapel, anyways. Yep, all on the Wolf Chapel done, or Wolf. wolf done. I called it the Wood Chapel for some reason, but no, it's the Wolf Chapel. And so with that done, we don't have to have to come back here ever again and have to worry about dying in such a stupid way I have to redo it. Yes, I know, we're good. Alright, well, let's see. Let's have a look at our puzzles that we got. Now we need to go back to the monastery real quick and have a look. Let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, yes. Oh no! Six. Six down. So six down, three more to go, and we will have to find those last three puzzles in the next video. So that being said, let's go ahead and end it off uh, for saving our game, of course, and our LP and our LP backup. Oh, wait, nope. LP backup. This one. Very good. All right. Well, that's about does it for today, folks. So, thank you so much, everyone, for watching. If you like the video as well as the other ones that I upload on here, then don't forget to drop like, comment, or subscribe. As I upload videos almost every day, so be sure to hit that bell and click those juicy notifications. Be sure to stay tuned for next time. Forget to some more. Let's play Hexen. So yes, finally, this is End of Coin Seventy Seven signing off. And as always, take care, everyone. Goodbye.